Hey guys, so uh, I just woke up, had breakfast and everything. I feel really good today. I slept real well over here at the truck stop in North Bend, Washington. And um, I'm getting ready to uh, grab some gas and then I'm gonna head back to Moses Lake. Uh, and my friend should be off of work tomorrow so I can hang out with him some more. And then Catalina's gonna be coming in on Thursday. So then we'll spend a day in uh, the Moses Lake area and then head out to Seattle and I'll get to show you a lot more of Seattle while we're out there. I also am hoping that I can get to the uh, Mount Rainier National P Park. Uh, hopefully it's still open and I can go around there. Either that or the Olympic Rainforest, one or the other. Uh, not sure which one I'd rather do so I'm letting Catalina choose that. and. Um, so I was able to get my passport card and everything. So I'm going to head up into Vancouver as well. And I'll talk to you guys a little bit later. Um, it's raining really <clears throat> pretty good right now. Uh, it's pretty normal for this side of the uh, mountains in Washington. Uh, now, the side of the mountains that I came from, which was the east side, it's, it's a rain shadow there. So... It doesn't rain that much so people think of rainy Washington they're really thinking of Western Washington so west of the mountains but anyways I'll talk to you guys in a bit and uh, see you later the west summit of Mount Baker. It's kind of hard to make out, but that's Mount Baker on the west summit. We just got out of the pass and uh, the trees are already getting thinner and shorter. So we're, we just got done being in the mountains, so now we're going into the foothills, down into the foothills, and then uh, pretty soon I'll be into eastern Washington. Hey guys, so just tie 10 more miles and now look, uh, it's pretty barren out here. Uh, it stays pretty windy. We have the... Uh, I don't know if you can see the windmill over there through the rain, but uh, they have a whole edge here along the ridge of them. And uh, I think that's interesting because it never was here before. So that's, that's all new, at least in the last 10 years. Hey guys, if you can see up there on that hill, there's a, a little channel between the two hills there. And uh, we got more of the uh, windmills there. So that's uh, the wind turbines, I guess, is a better term. And those are all new. Those never were there when I was living in Washington. I think it's pretty smart that they put the uh, wind turbines here in this area of the state because we've always like as long as I've known it everybody complains when they're driving through this section of freeway about how windy it is and Vantage all the time so I, I wouldn't be surprised if these are always turning
square ahead is the Columbia River, guys. So this is the Vantage area. Um, this is where uh, the Columbia River cuts and heads south quickly. Hey guys, so I'm back in Moses Lake, Washington, and uh, I'll be here until Catalina comes and flies into Spokane on Thursday, and then once she flies in on Thursday, that's uh, we'll hang out here for a day. I'll show her some stuff. I'll take her over to Soap Lake, and I'm gonna try to take her down to Grand Coulee and stuff, and uh, show her around uh, where I grew up. And then when I'm done doing that, I'm going to head out to Seattle and we're going to try to catch uh, either Mount Rainier National Park or uh, the Olympic Rainforest. So this, this is uh, pretty much the end of my day here. Uh, sunset and everything. I'm just going to go and find a Starbucks to hang out in before I head over to my friend's house and load up a video. So I appreciate you, everybody that's been watching all my videos. And uh, I want you guys to get out there and connect with people. Make sure you're living your lives. Don't just exist. And uh, make sure that you're creating an environment where other people can live the lives that make them happy. So I'll talk to you later. Peace.